busy team. Saturday night. Carpy 10 o'clock news. Sorry to interrupt your fucking your daily or nightly routines, but there's a couple of products you're gonna have to fucking have a look at, aren't you? I mean people have been going out of their fucking minds over this one. So first up, we have the Ridge Monkey Square Kettle. There it is in all its glory. Comes in two different sizes. Um, the unsociable side and do I really have to make you a cup of tea size? Um, so anyway, there's the square kettle. Opinions flying all over the fucking place, left, right and fucking centre. I mean, it's not like they're trying to reinvent the wheel, is it? I mean, I don't know what the fuss is about myself. Um, so yeah, if you want a square kettle, you know, the round one, it don't fit in your bag properly, does it? It goes in there and there's wasted room round the sides. You can get yourself a square one and it'll fit in there nice and neat amongst all you other square camo in your bag. Um, all your round one keeps rolling away and you're having a job keeping hold of it, get yourself a square one. Um, so there you go, there's that one. Um, whatever next. Um, Valley's Leds DPM little lead pouches are just about to hit the shelves they are. They come in four different sizes, small, medium, large and do I really have to carry this bastard round the fucking lake size? Yep, they boast 100% waterproof just in case you don't want to get your leads wet. Um, so if little lead pouches is your thing, they will soon be available to all, all, all your little lead pouch lovers. Um, so there you go, the Abode Two Man Continental Bivy has been released, I mean this thing's ginormous, I mean look at this. There you go, boasts ample room for two people, it's been specially designed to take the missus fishing, because as you can see, there's an anti-nag barrier in the middle, yeah, so if your missus wants to come fishing, keep that one in the back of your mind. And um, you heard it here first, didn't you? And um, so there's you go. And last but not least, this is a fucking great one. This one, we now I now bring you the Vass Camo Wader. Yeah, Vass are taking fucking water shots to another level. Yeah, you can now don some Camo Waders for the all important fucking in the water capture shot. I mean, fucking hell. As part of Vass constant development, this tough wader has become even tougher now boasts camo and um, the Vast Tech 700E Nova now boasts an addition of a new reinforced bass boot yet yeah, that's the fucking big yellow one that's going to blend into the camo even better yeah there you go so it's quad welded seams elasticated and box stitch brace loops um, easy repair to uh, material and an internal draw cord chest wader for safety and comfort we bring you the camo chest waders that's just in case you want to stand in the fucking bushes on a fucking sweltering hot day um, or some moist fucking shrubbery somewhere I mean I don't get it but anyway if camo's your thing the camo chest is they're fucking just about to hit the shells or they may be on the shells I ain't too sure um, so there you go that's the end of the carpy 10 o'clock news only a fucking short one um, I need to sort some stuff out um, so anyway thanks for watching and I doubt I'll see you soon